We're going to try a different cam camera angle today to see if you can see better with the lighting coming in from the window. This is Beltress Allegro 18 in the color Butterbeer Blonde. I have had this um, hmm, wave pattern in her probably since last fall sometime. So we're gonna try a couple different tools to see how they all work, compare them. This is the Lange straightening brush. I believe it's called Levite, L-E-V-I-T-E. -E. I've got it at 330 because it doesn't, oh, or 310, we could try 310. Always try lower first if that works before you go too high. So with this, I need to kind of put some tension on this left hand so that it goes across the hot plates at the bottom. And that worked. Because see, these, these bristles, they don't get hot. The only hot part, blah, 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 the only hot part is down there. Okay, so we know that works well enough. Let's try it again, just make sure it wasn't a fluke. Am I on camera? Yes, I'm still in my double fleece pants and my snow boot slippers because it rained good last night, had all the windows open, and it's only 60 degrees outside. It's cold. Hmm. Okay. That's not too bad. I'm impressed. I didn't think that would work. This girl's not in bad shape. Um, I did not wear her a lot. Probably only twice, three times, maybe. Okay, so my point of this is, think about how many tools you have just to work in your yard. I need a list of mine. Lawn mower, weed whacker slash edger, fertilizer spreader, weed sprayer, weed puller, digging tool, shovel, hoe, rake, cultivator, and a wheelbarrow. Just to name a few. So you can't always expect to do your wigs with just one tool. But we're going to try this one, see what we can get with this. We're going to see if it will straighten it as in refurbishing. Um, I also have it set at, let me look and see, 320 degrees. That looks like it might work also. I'm practicing this for a client that wants to buy a new tool and she needs to know what to buy. The only thing sometimes I learn sometimes I do with this one is you don't want a funny bend where you start when you put it in right here. We'll do this a couple of times, make sure that yes, it works. But again, if you're putting the tool up high enough up there, nobody's going to see that bend until you get to the top. I'm impressed. I'm impressed. So that answers my question. I think she can purchase just this one because she likes to curl it under. Um, this is by A Body. I believe that size is 1.25 inches. And it's, you can almost find it for $20. I have found it on Amazon. I have found it at walmart.com. So 
and I love this for even regular synthetics. This is a heat friendly synthetic. So I can go higher on the temperature. On a regular synthetic, you want to start about 180 or 190 degrees. And then if you feel like it's not doing the job, you can go up slowly. If you're hesitant, you can spray it with water first. And I probably forgot to say, always, 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 always have your hands clean when you're working on your wigs. Um, and for that reason too, I don't like product on my wigs. This wig is, like I said, I, I did this last fall, probably only wore her twice. She has no product in her. So, and the reason for that is I don't want product sticking on my curling irons and I don't want to cook product onto the hair. And I'm not really, I'm not letting that be um, tight, but I'm not really having to open it either. That seems to slide through nicely without getting um, caught, I guess is the word. I you know, sometimes I learn, lose my words. And I do have just a little bit of kink right in there from when I used that crimp iron, but I'm leaving it because I like fullness. Now I can see that didn't straighten out right there. So we'll come through with our comb again, comb it through, and then see if the heat will melt it the next time through. You can literally watch them go from crinkly to straight, and it did. Look at that. Okay. Well, that definitely answers my question because this has usually been my go-to. Lange, 320 degrees. The plates are nice. They're smooth. They don't damage or tug on the hair. The fine, fine hair goes through here um, without falling out. I can straighten and refurbish, but I can also put in a wave and I can even put in tighter curls. The only drawback is they've discontinued this particular one. Anyway, that answers my questions that these two work, and you can see me using this one in other videos.